Hello everybody, it's me Sam Crown from Proper Gaming and today we're showing the CCTV camera plugin for Bucket. This is by Sayard and Debu Jaron. Apologies if I said those names incorrectly. So Dan, what does this plugin do? This plugin will allow you to use a few blocks, you can change them in the config to create CCTV cameras to well, spy on anything you want really. So me and Sam have uh, had a nice village over here. Yeah, we found and that. we're going to spy on the, uh, in the inhabitants of them. So, the first block you want to place down is the dispenser. So we're going to place this, say, here. And we're also going to place down the screen. We'll just do that in a bit. But let's first just make this a uh, camera. So what's the command we need to type in? Right, so you want to do forward slash CCTV. Yep. Create camera. So I have a space between creating a camera yep. and then the camera name. So for, for just for this tutorial, we'll name it Whooper. Whooper. And then left click. So I'm going to just change game mode just in case. Right, there we go. So now let's go back to our secret spy hut and we'll place the screen. Right, so place it here. So this is black wool or grey wool and you can also define extra screens in the config and how do we create a screen? At create a screen you will do the same, you do cctv create and instead of camera you put screen and then the screen name so for example if you just want to put like screen 1 or just screen I'll, I'll have whooper and okay. then we'll have whooper and whooper okay. okay so now we've done that we need to link them so when you type in the command cctv link the camera name which is whooper and then the screen name which is also whooper and there we go link created right click the screen at any point to view the camera so have you viewed the camera All right. no, so if I, if I go first okay so what we need to do is right click the sign and then where we are go. you going? I am now viewing from the uh, camera now one thing you know I am bobbing up and down that's because there's nothing below me it's trying to keep me in that spot uh, but there's nothing that can be done about this unless you, right there you go, place a block below it. So there you go. And I can uh, look straight ahead and I can see from this angle. Um, so now I exit, I can right click to exit the view. Or I can type in CCTV exit. Uh, would you like to show, I'm going to go there and you, you go on it just to see what it looks like. So... Yeah, it, it doesn't work like that. It, only the creator can use it. All right, only the creator can use it. Okay. So now let's have a 360 camera because uh, that can only go in one way. But we want to see all around. So let's uh, let's place us on the roof here. Now this can be sponge or obsidian by default. We've chosen obsidian, but you can also add extra IDs in the config. And this works the same way. So CC TV create camera. CCTV create camera 360, let's call it now. And then left click. And then we'll go back and create our screen. So in our hut we go. <laughs> Place that down. Right, so we CCTV creates. Screen 360. Right click and then we'll link them up. And then this time when we right click, we have full 360 view. We can look up, we can look down, and we have a, a wider range of viewing. Which is quite cool. So you do. So there's a torrent there on the roof or a sponge block. Are you going to set one up as well? Yeah, I'm going to set my own one up so people can see what it looks like. Right, so let's exit out that, and while you're doing that, uh, I'll just show you how to delete a link. Quite simple, all you need to do is CCTV delete link, and then are you sure that you type in CCTV delete confirm, and then you left click on the screen or the camera to delete your link. So let's just change back. So, right, uh, I created mine, so if you teleport to me, you should be able to see. So there you go, that's how you delete a link. And now if we go to here, just... and there you go, that's what it looks like. You'll see the player 
surrounded by a glass block with a uh, glowstone below them, just because if it's night time, then uh, it will. Uh, you won't worry about to see all you. And then once they've gone, it will change back to the block it was. So you can see where the cameras are and when they're being used and not. Indeed. So that concludes this tutorial. It's quite funky. Uh, it doesn't require spout. I think it's really good because it uses the limited server like API to create yeah. something like this really well. So of course, it's got it's got nothing on the uh, the client mod, obviously, because that's a client mod. You can do a lot more with that. But for a plugin server, I think it's pretty good. Yes, and you can spy on the players. Exactly. And the players can spy on other players, and you could. Oh, probably this would be quite useful if you wanted to have like a mob spawner. You wanted to see how it was doing. Well, that's a good idea, you actually. Place one there and uh, check out how it's doing. So. But the uh, cameras in the screen are all configurable in the config, so they don't have to be SpongeBob's. That's quite obvious, but you know. Yeah. So, okay then. So, thanks for watching. This has been me, Sam here on Tarot Group Gaming, signing out.